131 on that. Keep it at 75. Why not? And another, like, steep incline up to the station. Alright, we do need to throw down some signals real quick before we run out of money. But let's get that loan. Ah, uh, buy trains. One. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Alright, set line, new line. Take it from here, Houston Central, to Dallas Annex. This is where the bl black gold is bubbling away here already. Hopefully we'll never run out. Otherwise, we'll probably have to breed new dinosaurs and then wait an eternity until they've I can't believe we're going to have to hear that every single time. <laughs> Game devs, come on. Come on. You know better than this. I'm sure you do. All right, we're going to increase this road width because we need the capacity. Not possible, you bastards. Can I delete this with my trucks on it? I don't think so. I assume it's because it clips too much with that. Or it has to do with this. Maybe because it clips with the station. If I ever don't have any trucks on here, then I'm going to delete this piece of road. Oh, I can just do that anyways. The trucks teleport away. Uh, okay, so let's... Uh, upgrade. not possible. Come on. I'm sure it's possible. I'm sure it's perfectly feasible. Uh, okay, so first thing, let's actually, let's sort of build it with these. You know what? Oh, get rid of that for now. Do it like this. There we go. There, now we have max throughput here. These are guardrails. I always thought they were like sound barriers. Also, this is not how guardrails work. It's not. Uh, I can increase this as well for when the time comes that we have things that are faster than 25 miles an hour. You know. I let that work that do its magic. You're getting here, you have to go up the hill like the other guy. Are you going to pick up how much? 17. Not the greatest start, but it's something. Alright, let's get to work on the other thing while those guys make money. Otherwise, we're basically just sitting here and watching them lose money. Oop. Okay, we're going to build track this way. And 
we're gonna double cross it. Oops, come on, let's do that. Too much slope? No, there's, there's plenty, there's not too much slope. No, you're wrong. Damn it, there's too much slope. Try it again. Should have done this side first. It's too much slope. How is there too much slope? Hmm. I think this should work because I set the I set the slope. Ah. That's not right. No, that's not right either. All right, let's do one side. Why? Why is it? How is it too much slope on this side? No, oh, it's totally fine. I swear. Oh wow, what is going on there, though? Hold on, that's not right. That's something's not. Something's not kosher with the way this is lining up. Alright, everything will look fine to you. Something wonky in the middle there again. You have to figure this one out. Until it snaps. Right there. Okay, it just doesn't want us to do this. What if I make it like flat? <laughs> huh? What happens then? Maybe they had it that way for a reason. Maybe I should have paid attention. Whoops, I accidentally deleted something that was kind of important. Uh, if I can get rid of this stub, yeah, there we go. Now they're now they're even. I need to get this up the hill. Let's see what we can get here. Industrial District of Beaumont. Where can I fit a station? Hmm. Obviously a terminal station is not going to do it. Also, wow, where did this wicked hill come from? How come we don't have the thing on anymore? Okay, there's a crazy hill right there. Okay, well, what if... Hmm, if I put this here, right? Is there any way I can get a track through town? The answer is actually yes. Holy crap. I don't want to do that though. That's that's nuts. Get rid of that. I know I know we spent a bunch of money to put that there, but it's not worth it to me. If I put Okay, I think I've I've spent enough money breaking and deleting, you know, breaking things and replacing them. Everything's gonna have to be that. Too much curvature. I 
Oh, I don't think we placed it right. It has to line up like that, though. We don't really have an option. Um, we had to connect these guys somehow as well. Well, first things first, I have to just aim this at the at the city. And by aim it at, I mean you know connect it to the city. That's a pretty well graded road. There's 135k, but. You know, sometimes you gotta pay the piper. 182k to repeat it there. And that's not terrible, I guess. Oh, that was supposed to connect to the other track. Hold on. Because we can get away with stuff like that now. Transport fever, not drink fever. It's the thing that's been trying to make me do forever and ever. I'll give this one more whack. There we go. It works. Alright, so we'll have that coming out and then. Just, uh, one, two, three, four. Cover all the bases, depending on what it picks. Oops, wrong way. Placed it the wrong way. And deleted the wrong thing. Wow, I need to get better at this. There we go. There we go. Alright, so what part of Belmont am I hitting? Mostly... Mostly residential. Which this is sort of a little bit of everything, so we shouldn't have too much problems. Too much in the way of issues with this. Wow, it took a lot to get this through here. I spent so much money. Is this the, is that the only that's the only problem? We do have to get up this hill still. Good gracious, we're spending money Just like no tomorrow. Yeah, we Just are. this once, our financial backers are willing to turn a blind eye and help us out once again. But this is definitely the last time. No, it's not. <laughs> I guarantee you, it's not. I'm going to be spending money like mad. You know, for the rest of the series. Man, we talked about the million dollar bridge last time. This is the six million dollar bridge. But have I go up there? Check contour lines. Oh, I just really can't get down there, can I? If I have a low bridge, like down here, I delete that. See, what I can do is go down like this. Sixty-five is still a decent speed, and then cross the river at a low point, which would cost a lot less. I'll probably have to bypass this at some point. But right now we have a couple trains that we can build. One of them being in here. Hmm. Where should I put it? Because there's not too many areas that are just flat. Put it up here, it's out of the way. 
No, that's not smart either. Again, none of these areas are flat enough to throw one of these depots. Hmm. Meep, meep. Alright, it's, uh, 43 now. We got the Zephyr. I'll build off here. See if we can get away with it. Spin it around. Wow, this thing's gonna be right in the water, isn't it? 72k for a depot? I think I'll pass. Oh, that's because it's like pointing at the ocean. Here, what I'll do, I'll put one here. That's that's a cheap thing to do. There. We can buy stuff there. I'll put a little cross over here. For now we can keep things on the wrong track, but uh, I will add a cross over here. Good. Put that there. Put a pair of signals here. There we go. I think trains will be held in the station if there's an issue, but... How much are these? A million bucks. How right, I'm gonna buy one of these. Set line. New line. I'm gonna run from here. To, uh, here. Remember? Why not? You know what? Yeah, why not? Okay. So this is still functioning. Things are still producing. We've got our two trains here. You are not full, but you're carrying half load, and you're not quite making up your money, but you're close. And then you are definitely making your money back. Uh, how much are you carrying now? 47. About the same amount. Is that just as much as the trucks can handle? Oh, it's going to operate again. This thing, this thing does a good job of being speedy. I have a lot of catchment area with this, but I could probably add a metro to make things a little bit better. I'm gonna wrap it around this way. I could see it happening. I could see it working. Do people want to work? You know, live here and work there. Most of this is residential. Fine, fairly low value. It's got some unemployed people. Nobody's unemployed there. Nobody's unemployed there. Unemployed people. Uh, and are there positions to be filled here? Jobs vacant 22. Oh yeah. So that's doable. Those people can start working here. Alright, we've got 1.49 million, 1.5 million, to spend how we please. Try to ship more items again. again. It's consuming the fuel like there's no tomorrow. But, you know, there you go. What's the next loan that we're getting? 8 mil. So we can definitely buy a freight train with that. We got somebody on board. 
Oh, do you have to just wait for him? Because that's disappointing. That's unfortunate if that happens. Alright, you're both ahead of the curve. We're not sure how long it's going to last, though. Still producing high. Six fuel, nine fuel. Yeah, this is a decent amount of fuel waiting. Spurred some growth here, it looks like. Hmm. The thing that I will need, though. I'll need to cross over further down than this. Like here. You know, for later. Let's get rid of the crossover there for now. Picked up anybody? No, you dropped somebody off. Did make 5k off of it, but that's not that much. Okay, and now there are four people waiting. Wow, that went up quick. How much are the uh, the diesels? One mil. Er. And we have box cars, which is for goods. So I do want one of these, one of these Alcos. The cheapest things we can get our hands on, except for a Mogul. Actually, a Mogul might not be a bad idea. What is the, uh, Mogul's cheaper. And it's a longer lifespan on it. Much lower attractive effort, though. I don't know. I think I'm gonna have to get the HX... HH600. Do we have to pay interest on the loans that we get? Or is it it's just investors, isn't it? These guys are making 400 k That's ridiculous. Cue another bit where I rant about how much the trucks make us. Okay. You guys are coming back at sort of the same time. It's just going to keep happening like that, isn't it? Ah, we should get the other one. It's definitely the last time. Financial backers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have double the money if I decided to, to like, go for broke on what we had, but I didn't really want to do that. I know, take a blind guess. I feel like the freight train is going to be lucrative. I mean, all things considered, I definitely hope it is. We'll add a third track to this when uh, when the time comes, because that would mean something else. It would mean something. I don't know. Wow, you're full. <laughs> you go, train. Oh yeah, you will have to wait. Womp womp. Eight hundred K from that though. Damn. Look at that. Look at how much money that just made. It's ridiculous. It's amazing. Well, that's the thing with, like, you know, inflation in the game, or in these games, you know, it's a real thing. Th stuff gets more expensive, and you also get more money from things. So you just see this, like, wow, I've never made that much before. Yeah, it's, you know, no surprise.
Okay, so should I get it? Should I take out the loan and get it? I don't know. I'm gonna buy this. We can only buy one more boxcar for it, though. And we can't do anything else with it. I wanna buy, you know, at least like eight. Although, we don't, again, we don't cover that much of the commercial district, so maybe it's a better idea not to. Alright, you did just pick up 13. I'm gonna do this upgrade now. Second straight connection, yes, because we won't ever need more than this. Hey, I don't honk at me. I'm, I don't feel like connecting this right now, but it is something that's gonna need to be... Check mark. And now we cover a much more commercial district. Yeah, we'll have to attend to this sooner or later. Oh, you're running the wrong way now. Uh. Oh, uh, wait, no, you're on. No, you are. You just run on the left side. Yeah, this is actually fine. We'll just have the freight train run on this track. Well, actually, what we'll do is we'll connect this to this. Oh, we're out of money. I feel like I say that a lot. Wonder why that is. <laughs> Wonder why I say that a lot. Oh, we're almost not out of money anymore. I think we need more trucks. I think we need more trucks. Oh, and there goes another year. Oh, we got some boats, some trains, and crap. Sweet. And he's gonna drop off like his measly couple of passengers. This place is already blowing up with what we've got. Yeah, so we're not gonna make that back real quick. So let's take out the bomb. Alright, buy trains. We're gonna put another like six on this. One, two, three, four. Oops, no wait, set line, new line. And you go from here down to the docks, to here. But you know what I need to do, actually? I need to make sure you guys, I need to make these guys basically run on separate tracks. This guy, if I tell him to go through the signal in both directions, right? There we go. And this guy, if I tell him to go through the, sig the signal in both directions. Okay, no, come back, I need to keep an eye on your line. It's automatically cows, by the way. There we go, now, now it'll do that. Cruises, man. Maybe we should have a third track for this. Theoretically, this should blow up with Holland with the ability to get stuff. 
Although getting this train out of here is going to be tough for this little guy. There's only half available at that other oil field. Oh my god, they gave us a million dollars. We'll have to just extend the line to this one instead when that one runs out. Dallas Oil Well 2. Let's get another 500. Yeah, hopefully this will work. You're doing fine. This guy... I assume this guy's making good money. No, he's not. He's not covering his expenses. Is it because it's such a short distance? I, I mean, he's covering his expenses now. For the first year, he didn't. But. <laughs> I just like that we... I was less like, yeah, we'll get one of these things out there. And it works. This guy's cruising at 27. These sad little Virginia trucky box cars. Uh, Houston is definitely filling out around the station. That's good. How much is waiting for us now? Just five. Hmm. Not exactly the boon I was hoping for. But hopefully it'll provide another outlet for those guys. Maybe we should add a second, uh... Second thing to these guys to help them out. Twenty-two K. Well, we've had worse. You've made exactly ten percent of your operating costs back. You know what? We need to do a double slip. So if I connect this to here, right? Can I do this? Nope. No, I thought we could make double slip switches now. segment. I guess we can't do that quite yet. Hmm. Well, that isn't uh, really well. I do to do that. Shut up. Stop honking at me. You know, maybe I could bump this back a little bit. It's like, how far back can I attach this? I can get away with putting it there. Get rid of part of it. No, that was not part of it. Problem is, I don't want that curve to be so tight. Yeah, it's, that's pretty bad. That right there. I don't want these guys to really interfere with one another. So, my temptation is to 
bring R2. I put a cross over here, right? And then let these, let this, so have a second one and then just have them pass each other on this section here. Meanwhile, why would you not? Why, why, why do you have to intersect like that? Well, we need a waypoint. Waypoints should be free. Right here. Uh, details. Overview. Fine. On the way into Beaumont. Should pass through there. On the way out of Beaumont, too, goddammit. There. You can't quite reach the whole district there, but... Hey, there's 100k. That's pretty good. It's a lot better than what we had. Here comes the motor car. Moto Simmons. All right, we need more trucks, like many more trucks. Like a double the amount of trucks that we currently have. That sounds like a lot of trucks, you just don't understand trucks. Actually, it's a ton of trucks, but you also might not understand trucks, just on the basis that, you know, you might not. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. If that doesn't freaking do it, I don't know what will. Let's go, get the trucks out. Trucks out for Harambe. Look at him, truck army, go. If they're not, like, bumping into one another at the stations, they're not close enough together. Alright, it's time to work on this. There, we have the bridge. That's gonna be the most expensive thing for a while. We do have to get up this hill, though. What's our next stop? Lake Charles. It's the town of Lake Charles. Uh, where should I put the station? I have a few options. So, I, I still put a line through here for a few hundred K, although I don't really want to. I think that's what I just aimed us for. Like, we don't have an option now of, of settled us. You know, we're going right into the danger zone. So I came out of the radio today, I was like, oh my god. I think we might want to go around. And then terminate here in... I almost called it LA. It's not LA. It's NO. It's Norlands. Alright, where are the districts? There's a tiny industrial district at one end. We're going through here. 200k. Check the contour lines as well. This is the highest point of Lake Charles. Well, like, how bad is it? Because if we go, like, the more oblique of an angle that we enter the town at, the worse it's going to be for us in terms of number of buildings we have to remove. You know, going through the middle might be, you know, initially painful, and, you know, throwing a second track in there is going to be even worse. But, the fact of the matter is, it might just be cheaper in the long run, and it'll be more direct. Now, but especially if I put a station like here. Well, we need to think about that. We need to figure, where are we putting the station? Although, uh, the, train here, the terrain here is, is much nicer. We've got a GG1. Three 
your buildings will be removed. Well, if I make it a two platform station. Yeah, this is kind of where I would want to put it to. It's a 500k station. 700k station. 500k station. 600, actually. I mean, we should do it before the price goes up. That's what I'm thinking. Question is, can we get a train through here? We can. We can do that. Oh, but we can't do the second track. Nuts. Um. Come on, I believe. Damn it. No, and they're putting stuff there already. Oh well. We'll have to have some service that like terminates at Lake Charles, or we'll only be able to, one, to use one track at the station or something. Let's get rid of this road. Build that piece of track real quickly. Oops, I missed a spot. Huh. The neighboring state, Louisiana, is suffering particularly badly from the weakened economy. The city of New Orleans is struggling to ensure supplies for its residents. The governor of Louisiana, a certain Huey Kingfish Long, is therefore asking us for help. The man's political ideas may be disastrous, but he's making us an interesting offer. <laughs> if we guarantee security of supply in New Orleans, he'll grant us the exclusive rights to the offshore oil rig off the coast of Louisiana. Where? That might be worth it. Where? Ooh, I see. Well, I'm working on it. I'm trying to get us there. But, uh, I think I should leave that up for myself. How much is waiting? Thirteen. Eh, not that many. Not that much. Eh, uh, you're doing better, man, but you're not that good. Well, I think I'm gonna leave it here. This is uh this has been fun so far. I've been liking the scenario. We've got a lot more to do though. I really need to branch out. I don't think we're gonna be worrying about hitting uh 75 million at any point, but then again, we're only just at the very beginning. They said it could take until uh you know, 55. And we're gonna ramp things up. We're gonna ramp things up hardcore. Oh, we do seem to be eating away at that anyways. I'm just gonna upgrade again. Oh my god. What are we gonna do? We're gonna need more trucks! Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you next week. Train Man out.